that's him. Oh, ooh, that's a scrappy boy right there. Oh yeah. Good morning. It is 722. I gotta adjust the clock on my uh, fish finder here. 722, we are uh, out here. We are fishing Redondo. Um, I think we're doing some rock fishing. We just left the launch not long ago. It's pretty flat out here. Hopefully it stays like this most of the day. Um, go link up with Juan here. I got Eric right here over my left shoulder. You guys probably can't see him yet, but you will in just a minute. And um, yeah, we're gonna see what we can come up with today. Not doing any kind of uh, super hardcore paddling. Maybe a five or 10 mile day, something like that. Something where it's not, um, you know, we're not going for any real distance here. It's pretty cold out and I'm not wearing a wetsuit. I have a dry suit. Not really a dry suit, even more of a paddling jacket is what I'm wearing. So a paddling jacket, paddling pants. So it does have a gasket, but it's not, um, you know, by no means is it like uh, rated for falling into the water that's cold. And I'm reading water temp of 54, and I think the air temp's about 60. So it is, uh, you know, we're below the 120 rule. I really should have worn a wetsuit, but I uh, thought it might warm up and get hot. So it might get hotter today. We'll see how it goes. But uh, anyways, I'll pick you guys up uh, shortly. I'm gonna link up with Juan here. We'll go uh, make a couple of mackerel for bait, and uh, we'll go from there. Push jig that I made. Doesn't feel real heavy, but we'll see what it's like. Gear, so it feels huge, but you know, oh, decent Picatio. Right in there, a ah, little one again, a little guy, but he's a keeper, we'll keep him. It's me for freezer. Octopus jig. So essentially an octopus that I injection mold, put over an eight-ounce sinker and attach some assist hooks to the bottom, popular to a uh, or similar to a uh, another overpriced lure that's on the market, but uh, pretty complicated mold here to make, you know, but pretty cool. So. Anyways, we're gonna put this here for now. I'm gonna, I don't want this to drop all the way back down. You're on? This guy's got some pretty nasty teeth on him. Let's see, I might kill him first and then I'll show the teeth. got them in the brain because they'll do that. Oh, got them in the artery, squirt blood out everywhere. Bloody deck, bloody pants. Got meat for the freezer. 
Let's keep it going. I think I'll put a live bait on there because I can't imagine that they're going to be live in here very long with all these other dead fish in here. They're still rocking though. Oh yeah. Is that big mac at? Let me do this thing. Check that line, make sure it ain't busted. Line feels good. Line feels good. I don't really care about that line as much, but that feels pretty good too. A little nick in it, but that's just the weight. We're not a big deal. That comes off, I'm not gonna die. And then macro is he? He's that slimy bastard. It's a fish. Ouch. Slime stick, where is he? Let me try this guy. Hmm. All right, let's get to work. Damn, I don't know what it is. Oh, I bet you I know what it is. God dang. The polarizing's coming off my lenses. It's making it really difficult to read my screen. Sometimes those fish, those birds sound like people talking, man. Huh? Yeah. Okay. Man, I really want to jig, but I don't want to lose my equipment, you know? All right, oops. Okay, here we go. Very nice, here we go. All right, we got to take our dock picture when we get back, dude. Load them up, we'll lay all the, well, Quan won't have the solo there. That's kind of a bummer, it'd be nice if he did. You know, I kind of like when we lay our kayaks out at the end, we get back. Kind of cool. Yeah. 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 Yeah, man, we, we had, that was a, that day was like probably the best day weather wise that we had all year for fishing, I think. Yeah. All right. Let's see if we get a biter here. I should have known that one was a sand bass. By the way, it was shaking. Those little bastards are probably. The, I, my opinion, they're the scrappiest fish down there. Let's see, something's taking a nibble here. Okay. Is that him? That's him. Oh, ooh, that's a scrappy boy right there. Oh yeah. Oh, it's a feisty boy. Ooh. Oh, broke off. Oh damn. Did it take my hook and everything? I think that was a linger because I've seen them on like underwater videos when they strike and they sometimes don't eat the hook because they bite the side of the bait. Damn, Quan, I think I just lost a linger. Yeah. yeah, I'm sure it didn't break my line. My leader's too heavy and I felt it pull, so I'm thinking it was biting the fish but not didn't inhale it yet. 
That's what I was wondering, but I checked it and it seemed like the only thing that was damaged was maybe the line going to the to the uh, weight, and I could feel my weight there. So I don't think I lost, um, I don't know, we're gonna see right now. Nope, just took my bait. All right, so it is 10.45 a.m. Uh, I've got five fish, I think, in the hatch, maybe six. And um, just dropped down. I had a nice hookup a little bit ago, but it didn't stick. So I think it was link. I think it bit my uh, bait. Sometimes they'll bite the bait from the side and they won't get the hook because I put the hook in the nose. My arm's too bad. But uh, we'll keep on trying. Fish in the same spots, nice wreck. So see if we, see if they want to eat this thing. Otherwise, it's been Boccaccio's other than one big sand bass. I shouldn't even say a big sand bass, a decent sand bass. Got the deck a little bloody over here. Kind of nasty. Sorry, that's what we're here for. Alright. Yeah, I think I'm off that spot now. I'm not seeing a bunch of life down there. Pull this guy up and get back on that rack. You out of bait? Let's see what I got. I might have something. Let's see here. Aha. Uh -huh. Let's give her a go. What's this? Snag City? Oh, we got a biter. Oh, ho, ho. hefty biter. Hefty biter. Let's go. On the on the halibut bait. Is it heavy? Uh, yeah, it's pulling good. Oh yeah, he's pulling drag on me. Oh god. There we go. That's legit. You want the net or are you using the gaff? I'm gonna gaff oh, there we go. Yeah. Let's see that. On 
on the freaking. Dude, I got him on that plastic halibut that I poured. No way. Yeah. Hey, Daniel. So I threw that plastic halibut down at the wreck out here. What do you think about that guy? Do you want the net? I'm gonna get him in the hatch right now. <laughs> That's awesome! Stoke pack. What I want is to get this out of here for a minute. Nothing. I'm just trying to get my hatch open so I can get him in there. Oh. Oh, look at that. Something in his stomach. Yeah, Maybe probably. Pregnant. Yeah. <laughs> Congrats. Thanks, man. I'm stoked. Woo! Woo!